afternoon everyone, it's Sunday, and I know I'm dressed up, it's because I just got back from a wedding. The reason I'm making this video is to respond to Naraman's 2011 YouTube survey. So without further ado, let's go. Question number one, what was your first kiss like? I actually have never been kissed before. I think the reason for this is because unlike many girls my age, I think that a first kiss should be something more than, oh he's nice to me, he's decent looking. He likes me back and he said we should, you know. So I know it seems like a miracle to some of you, a teenage girl who hasn't been kissed, what? I know, but it's going to be something really special for me and I'm still waiting. Question number two, what's the most expensive casual item of clothing that you own? They are probably these beautiful platform shoes. They were $120, I did not buy them myself. My mom and my aunt split them put the cost for them for me to wear to homecoming and they were beautiful and I love them. Question number three, what's the first job you wanted as a child? At my preschool graduation, the teacher read out loud what each kid wanted to do as they grew older and I responded, quote unquote, to just be normal. Seeing as right now I'm wearing a formal dress talking to a camera on a Sunday afternoon in the middle of my room when I should be doing homework, I'd say that this goal is going pretty well. Question number four, tell us about your group of school friends. I'm, de I'm destroying this question and talking about my group of church friends because my school friends are boring. My church friends and I refer to each other as the group and we have a Facebook group titled the group and we also have a YouTube page which currently has nothing on it but I will share the link once it does and it comprises of boys and girls that I've known since we were about three years old and we didn't start really hanging out until 7th grade, but now they are the closest friends that anyone could wish for. And most of them are a year older than me, so it, there's going to be two of us left once the seniors graduate. And I have no idea what I'm going to do with my life. Right now it consists of the boys, Marco, Trent, Curtis, Evan, Alex, and Jordan. And four girls, me, Keely, Christy, Sarah, and Brittany. So they are the best friends that I could ever have in the world, and once we start making YouTube videos, if we ever do, I will be sure to share the links with you guys. That way you can get to know these wonderful, awesome people. I love them. Question number five. What would you call your kids? Like Naraman, I find this question really awkward because number one, I'm not sure if I want to have kids, and number two, I'm not sure if I'm going to have kids, if I would like to pre-name them or determine their genders. I do know one thing. My grandma started a tradition where she would name one of her daughters something with a weird spelling with an E-E. -E. So my mother is Jody with two E's, J-O-D-E-E. -E. And I am Keely with K-E-L-L-E-E. -E. So if I have a daughter ever, she will obviously be named something with two E's. I think that the uniqueness is kind of cool. I know some people find it obnoxious, but I like the name Keely. And it's kind of funny to see how people try to pronounce it. Question number six, who would you like to have answer the survey next? Well, assuming that Hank Green is going to answer the survey in his next video, I would like to see Toby Turner or Tabuscus answer the survey next. Thanks for watching, you guys. If you want to post your own response to Naraman's annual YouTube survey, I will put a link down below, and I hope you guys have an awesome rest of the week. See you later. Bye.